Hi there, it's Darren O'Neill from Darren's Tech Tutorials. Uh, before we begin, if you like this video, please do like and subscribe as it really does help with the algorithm. And if I really did help you, please check out my Patreon, which I'll link below. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install um, VirtualBox guest editions on CentOS 9 stream. So I have CentOS 9 here and I have it running in VirtualBox. And to kick off, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to the terminal. And I'm actually just going to go sudo yum update first. And let's just update everything and make sure everything's up to date. And let me pop in my password here. And while this is uh, updating, I'll just double check that. Um, I'll just pause the video and this will update everything now. Okay, for me, there's a ton of updates here. So what I'm going to do is going to press Y to begin the updates. What I'll do is I'll, I'll pause this because this will take a while to run. Okay, so we're back here and this looks good. Um, so next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get the Apple repo. So I'm gonna type in sudo yum. I'm gonna have this uh, URL here. So sudo yum install and this URL, and I'll leave this URL somewhere where you can get it. So what I'll do is just press return on this and I'll be prompted for my password. So let me just type that in. And then it should um, prompt us when I click yes, we do want to do this. And then it should get the Apple repo. So we've got the Apple repo for us now, which is great. So we'll then move on to the next part of the tutorial. Okay, great. So we're going to get some additional packages now. It's going to type in sudo yum install. And I'm going to type in gcc. And again, I'll leave this somewhere where you can just um, copy and paste. But let me type it all in here for completeness. there and let me hit return on that okay i'll just pause this again while these commands uh while this information is being installed okay so it looks like i have a typo here so let me press the up arrow and change this to e and we'll just try run this one again and let's see yeah this looks much better so let me click yes on this and again th this will take a couple of minutes so i'll just stop the video here while, while this is running Okay, great. So we're already getting somewhere now. All this is done. So the next thing I'm going to come up, I'm going to click Devices. And I'm going to click Insert Guest Editions CD Image. So hopefully now that will insert. Yep. And we can see the option here. I want to do, I want to click Run. And I'm going to be prompted for my password. So let me type that in and I'll hit Authenticate. And this should begin to hopefully do what it needs to do. So again, let me just... Uh, Pause the video here while this is running. Okay, so it looks like this is done. So I'm going to press return to close this window. And then I'm going to come up, I'm going to click on the power, I'm going to click power off and log, log off, and I'm going to click to restart. Um, and I'm going to click get yeah, install pending software updates and click restart. And let me just pause the video again while this is rebooting. Okay, so our CentOS machine has now restarted. So let's see if this works. And there we go. I can maximize it without issue. So that is it. You've now seen how to make uh, CentOS 9 full screen on VirtualBox by installing guest editions. Again, if that was helpful, please do like and subscribe. And please do consider looking at my Patreon if this did help you. And as always, thank you for watching.